Hello everyone, this is the second devlog that I am hosting, that I'm making and I want to show you some new features that I have added to my game uh, so let, let's start with this uh, first I have added some uh, parts of the story here so for example if you find uh, in the game if you find these items these are notebooks or books you can find parts of the story it will take you to a different room and here you can read uh, the story I also changed the music I, I've added some new music and it changes here in this part so here you have the story and you and all along the game you will find different parts of the story uh, so <clears throat> that's something new it keeps story if you want to read the story you can come here to this part and here you can uh, just press you can click and go to the stories <clears throat> so part one here imagine you are walking around the place and you find the other one we have the story again the different parts all the different parts they get stored here you can read them anytime you want and the third part of the story okay um I also, here you can see these uh, spheres, these objects, or these blue balls. Uh, they are bombs. If you click on them, they will explode. Okay, here's another one. And they, they will kill the enemies, they will burn the walls. Can you see? Here the sprites changed because the wall now it's burnt uh, these bombs will also destroy some of the trees and some of the items and of course your enemies so be careful to be away when you activate the bombs because they will hurt you as well okay so let's see I will show you another one Okay. It is supposed to it is supposed that the player will collect these bombs or will uh, buy them. I don't know yet, but you can press in, if you press the U key, okay, letter U, you can uh, you can put these bombs, you can plant these bombs around the map. And then when you're away you click on them that's something new I created this morning and these are the the cars the items that you have to collect in order to get the bombs so you go whenever you find one of these you know that it's a bomb And then when you want to explode the bomb, you just click on it. So let me show you this new weapon in a different part of the map. For example here, this bomb will also activate this... Uh, this this bomb will also activate these mushrooms. As you can see here, it will explode. Okay, I died. And it will change the sprites of these trees. They will get burnt and they will get some fire as well 
I'll try to plant the bomb here. Okay. So I have... I left the bomb there, and now I will walk away and then explode it by clicking on it. As you can see the sprite have they have changed here the rocks are burnt the trees they have some fires uh, it also works for these doors in these doors you need a key to open them or you can plan you can put a bomb there and walk away run away and just explode the bomb, the, the door, sorry. Now there's no, uh, there's no door. It's burning and you can just walk through this part of the map. Cause there's no, there isn't any door. Um, something else that I have added here are these bars you have the you have the life here you have the attack the level the xp and gold and while you get more of these points these bars will uh, get longer they will get uh, larger and you will see your progress by different color bars it's pretty interesting. For example, if I fight, you will see that the life here, uh, it, I lose life, and it goes down, it decreases, and the XP is increasing here. So I will heal my character. Okay, I got. I have got my five points of life and I will continue uh, training my character. You can see that my XP, the XP bar is getting uh, longer. So that's something cool, I think that's pretty interesting because you have a visual idea now of what's going on, it's not only numbers anymore. Um, what else? Uh, there's this... Uh, key counter here, this key button. Uh, it shows the quantity of keys you have. Then you have the mineral counter, mineral rocks counter. The, um, if you click on them, it, they don't do anything. Uh, the potion button, if you buy some potions, you will be able to use them by clicking on this button. And then you have the history here. If you click on it, you will go to the history uh, room, okay? So that's all for today. I hope to bring more uh, updated. I hope to bring more updates later. Sorry for Sorry about my broken English, it sucks, I know, sometimes it's hard to speak in English uh, Hard to speak English While playing the game, while thinking about what to say, but I'm doing my... I'm trying to do my best, so it's okay I hope you have enjoyed, remember that I will uh, Leave the link to the... To this game On Game Jolt and to other websites so if you want to try it just go there and 
see it by yourself. Thank you very much and see you later.